Well, hello, everyone. Welcome back to Side Quest and the Shadow Keep, but not for long. We're going to a new place. There's going to be lots of new things today. It's very exciting. I'm looking forward to it. New look, for one, an almost complete Fire Knight look, just because it's, I don't know, new and cool. Also, new place. We're going to explore a new place and also try out some new toys. Toy number one. This thing. It's quite the look. It's from the Putrescent Knight. I don't love the reach on it, I'll be honest. But it is big. And it's got this move. Which is a little ridiculous. Very ridiculous, in fact. It'll be good times. Anyway, this looks pretty. Goodness. Boy, that's gorgeous. I can't really remember the last time from had us go to such a lush forested looking place. The Elden Ring had some more forested areas, I guess. I guess it had a few. Altus had some forested areas. Even Limgrave Weeping Peninsula had some areas that were a little bit more foresty, especially up on Stormhill, but this feels like it's escalating things a bit. Gorgeous looking. Where to even start? Been a bit since we got to enjoy that good sunshine. We've been indoors. In the most complex keep ever. For so long. Here's an elevator. That's... One thing, which I guess will take us down here, probably. One thing at a time. Man. There's so much in this DLC expansion. It is vast in a wonderful way. It really is almost like a mini sequel. And mini in heavy air quotes. This is like, we've already spent a good I don't know, nearly 40 hours, probably 40 hours total <laughs> in here already, and there's still plenty more to do. This is already, like, a full-sized game. It's only miniature in comparison to the base game of Elden Ring. And even then, not that miniature. Boy, we can just go in several directions. This seems like a weird little detour, though. Let's start here. Help! No, no. I'm okay. It's fine. Bond stone and antiquity scholars cookbook. Huh. A record of crafting techniques left by the horn sent academics who study the ancient ruins of Rao. Details techniques for working with sprites thought lost to antiquity. Oh yeah, sprite stone and such. 
but also bond stone, a large burrow stone studded with a perfectly white gem said to be the polished form of a special kind of crystal, a ritual implement made to control explosions of spiritual power used to cause a spiritual explosion, consuming the sprite dwelling within the sprite stone. Bonds with the sprites were made to be broken. Reusable. Interesting. And weird. Hmm. Am I kind of stuck in here? Could try causing a little explosion. To get out. Eh, why not? If you're gonna give me a weird little toy... Might as well give it a try. So, um... I don't feel like that really caused... An explosion, per se. Hmm. Interesting, though. Is that taking health? No, no. Huh. That's real... This is very interesting. I don't know how to use it yet, but... Huh. Well, I'm a little stuck in here, it seems like. Hmm. Might just have to warp out. Though that feels a little bit suspicious, like it's not often that From drops you into places where the only answer is to warp out to get back to places you <laughs> have been before. Usually, there is some way out. Hidden path ahead, huh? Like, I don't know... Oh. That kind, a more conventional kind. I see. Hello. A little less pleasant on this side, I notice. A little bit. Ah, there's multiple. Why are there so many multiple? I hate that. There's a lot of multiple. No. Dislike. Dislike and disapprove. Alright. We're doing this. I'm just gonna keep on swinging. And spinning. And if someone gets in my way, it's their own fault. Yeah, you're a little faster than me. Anyway. What do we got out here? Where'd those other scorpions come from, anyway? Huh? Well, we got little ones. Still pretty sturdy. Considering the size of the thing I'm hitting them with. Yes, hello. You're terrible. Hello, hello, little ones. 
Boy, I wish this thing had a little more reach. The spin attack is very fun. Huh? Oh. This is like a whole complex in here. Interesting. Let's finish looking on this other side real quick. Can I mount up in here? I can. Okay. Ghosts. More ghosts. Ghost with vase on head. Priority target. Eh. That... Well, you don't have the vase anymore. I guess the vase is just... Hey. Okay, sparkling ones. Ah, you got away. It's ones with sparkling vases. I see. Got away from me. Dang. Huh. Ah, excuse me. I was going to live and let live. I see that's not what we're doing today. Unbelievable. Yeah, I guess this is my path. Whoa! <laughs> Boy, everything just learns to roll in this world. Absurd. Okay, seeing a couple of y'all in here. At least. At least two. Mm-hmm. Maybe... I like that solution. I wonder if I can use any of those new, uh... Fire, uh, toys that we got last time. Now I was gonna roll... Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Be that way. Yeah, next grace fire we find. Let's see if I can equip any of the new... Fire incantations we picked up yesterday. I don't know for sure if I can, but... Yoink. Pardon me, don't mind me. Thank you. Already a little easy getting turned around. Trying to explore this place. But let's try to be thorough. I see you up there. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. Not sure how that missed. Top off for safety. Hey, how did that hit me? Disagree. Yeah, I can do big spinny moves too. I don't know if I dare risk it.
There we go. It's so pretty here. At least the outdoors. And if anything, the grungy indoors just make you appreciate the outdoors even more. Ooh. I like the look of that. Haha, -ha, you. You. Got one of you, at least. I really need to go get that other one. Can't make him respawn unless I can find a grace fire, though. I appreciate that most everything is ignoring me, though I don't trust that one will. Nope. Bizarre. And now y'all aren't ignoring me, are you? Nope. You're even using new tricks. And another scorpion. Eh. Here we go! We're spinning. We're spinning. We're spinning. We're spinning. That's right. It is a fun toy. Very good move in certain circumstances, and in other ones I expect, boy, that'd get you very vulnerable and killed <laughs> very easily. Yeah. Still dislike. Still greatly dislike. Okay. Haha! -ha! Too fast for you this time. Oh, you're a big one. Still dislike you. Whoa. You went all pale when you died there. That was kind of cool. Still gross. Still gross. Spider scorpion ashes. No thanks. I'm good. I don't... That's... that's help I don't want, I'll be honest. Gonna respectfully decline. I would rather be murdered than be saved by that. It's so pretty. And boy, am I getting lost. We're here now? Okay. Cool. Gorgeous out here. We do have another toy to play with. Remember this? The milady? The light greatsword? I do rather like the elegance about it. And it's got like... It's got an interesting Ash of War that's kind of like... Made for it, it seems like. Wing stance, I think, is what it was. 
Yeah, just like changes your move set. That's really cool. I know I've also got like a fire spear Ash of War that I got last episode, but it's not quite that cool looking, is it? Okay, I see a Blood Fiend. And a bug, of course. Yes, I see you. Get out of here. Don't even. Hmm. No. Don't. Where to go? Aha! Oh. Not quite what I was going for. It is a very cool weapon, though. I feel like I'm halfway to a Hornet cosplay here, and I like it. What else can I reach from here? Anything? I could maybe jump down there. That, eh, that could work. This could also work. Both seem risky a little bit. A little bit. Hmm. There was an elevator back in here too, wasn't there? I think. I thought I saw a lift at one point back, I think here. And I temporarily ignored it because there were enemies. But I could have sworn. Somewhere back here. Somewhere. Also, there's this. What is this? Oh, I can jump down there. Okay. That looks like Spirit Spring. Okay. It is Spirit Spring. Yes? Yes. Okay. Well. Don't mind if I do? Okay. Ah, uh, man. You could be cool about this. I'm just gonna... Okay. Just gonna leave you be. I was gonna. I really would have loved to have had that option. They sure did put a lot of very gross enemies in one of the prettiest places. I saw a thing here. Yeah, that's a little further than I meant to jump. Might as well grab that. But yeah, I saw I saw a ledge. Haha. -ha. Oh, it's just a mushroom. Well, mine now.
What other horrors we got down here? Volunteers? Several? Okay, good. Good and hooray. Love it. I do love how fast this milady swings. It's not quite got the same damage output of other great swords per swing, but you get in a lot more of them back to back. Which is kind of nice. Yeah. 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 There we go. Oh, which way? Let's try this one. Y'all really do look quite corpse-like until I get close enough for you to get up. I'm gonna have to be careful about that. I see something up on the ceiling. Might just be roots and pattern. Okay, yeah. I think we're okay. Nice. What is that? Fine crucible feather talisman. A talisman fashioned from thin feathers that embody the aspects of various creatures, said to have grown on the human body long ago. Ooh. Improves back steps, but increases damage taken at all times. Yikes. Hornscent view the crucible as sacred for the refinement wrought through its evolutionary gifts. Most prominently, their tangled horns. I would love to learn more about the crucible. I think I'm in the right place, and but then there's also this. Used to summon the spirit of a spider scorpion, if you want. The scorpion's larger than a human and attacks with pinchers and a poisonous tail. Appears some distance from the summoner. And that's at least good, better than close. This breed of a scorpion was native to the realm of shadow, but was far smaller in size. Recent giant scorpions are said to trace back to the church of the bud. Don't think I'd like this church. I'm not on board with the church of the bud. Eh, I don't like your buzzing sounds. At all. At all. I don't like a lot about this. Nope. No grabs. Where's the rest of you? Not gonna just leave that be, I'll have you know. Yeah. Little slow. Poke. Yeah. I says poke. Better. Very strongly mixed feelings about this whole location. Lots of things I either very love or very don't. Nope. Stop. A lot of y'all in here. Cool. Even the guard counterattack is like a double slash thing. Now, uh... Hate it. Stop. 
Mm. Awful. All of you. Two of you up there with a the shiny I want. Okay, that's how we're getting there. Perfect. I'm here for the shiny, but also to destroy the both of you, because I just... I've decided I don't like y'all very much. Thank you. Yeah. Not a fan. Also not a fan of you two. Okay, we got us another little mini boss here. I see. Blocking the way to the Grace Fire. Rude. Could probably just sneak past, but... Don't know if they're gonna let me. I guess the last one kinda let me. Hey, nice. I'm grateful. So, another of those. Excellent. A message. A message left by Dryleaf Dane, addressed to kindred spirits who also pursue Mikola's trail. We've found the sealing tree just ahead, but if we are to burn it, we need the proper kindling, that of Sir Mesmer. Ah, I see. Hmm... So pretty. I abandon here the last of the flesh of my body. Huh. I would sort of think that the last would be closer to where I assume Mikola is. Inside there, at the top of Bellarat. But I suppose there's a lot about Mikola's plans that I don't... ...fully grasp yet. First this... Hooray. Next... Spells-wise... Is there one of these new fire incantation toys that I actually can use? These are the, all the old classics. That one is a little beyond my current levels of faith. Working on it. Maybe there aren't any other than like the Ashes of War that I've picked up that I could use. I think so. Which is fine, it's not like I'm hurting for toys, and also I do still really mostly play melee, but... It is nice having the ranged options. And they're only gonna work better the more I put into faith. I feel like using the bigger sword on this one's gonna make a lot of sense. Hello! I would love to... talk first. If that's of interest to you. Instead of fighting? Okay, this is also... This is also fine. Neat hammer. If I win, can I have it? Ow. I also have fun big weapon tricks. Like spinning. This is gonna hurt. Yeah. 
As with... Whoa -ho -ho -ho. As with most Crucible Knights... What? That's wild. As with most Crucible Knights, they have all the poison in the world and there's no... staggering them out of anything. Oof. Guess we can try her other toy. Yeah, that may be a bad idea, but... Heck of a move you got there. And a heck of a power. I'd love to have that power as well. It's all very good. Yep. Oh boy. Now, uh, none of that. Oh boy, that stacks up hits quickly. Tough cookie. There we go. Whew. Devonia. You did give me your hammer. How nice. I would also love some of those powers if possible. I expect I won't get them. Some of those were a little wacky. A crucible hammer helm worn by Devonia. Longest serving of the Crucible Knights. Holds the power of the Crucible of Life, the primordial form of the Erd Tree. Strengthens aspect of the Crucible incantations. Ooh. It is said Devonia quested in search of the Crucible's origin and departed from the lands of the Erd Tree alone. And Devonia's hammer. Weapon forged of primordial gold, marked by its reddish hue and inhabited by ancient holiness. A torrent of life is engraved upon the striking face. Devonia's Vortex uses the power of the Crucible Vortex, violently spinning the hammer around and slamming the ground, causing a shockwave. The skill can be charged to increase its power. Cool. Neat new toys. Let's go heal up. That was challenging. Let us also... Hmm. So we're here now. We've explored a lot in here. Hopefully not all in here yet. I think there's a little more to do in there. Let's... There was one more spirit spring that I could jump up from before walking out here and fighting Devonia. Let's go back and, like, check that real quick. before moving on and forgetting. Let's just bypass all the bugs. Pretend they don't exist. La 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 la. Can't see or hear you or anything. Here we go. Bye. Jumps. I'm here now, whatever this is. Huh. Bunch of little snails around. Oh, this kind. This kind of snail. Y'all aren't gonna summon things at me, are you? Or shoot crystals? Or skulls? You, you snails have actually been all kinds of like, trouble. In the base game. Like, multiple varieties of trouble. They're a very versatile hazard in Elden Ring. These snails.
What have I found here? Hey, hey! Perfect! Yay! I'd almost forgotten about you. Three spirit calculus? What are those again? It's been a little bit. Oh, they're a crafting item. Huh. Well, good. Glad this is where that wound up, because I had just about forgotten about that. <laughs> Particular vase holder. Okay. Well, there. Now I feel a little more satisfied with the coverage down and in here. I want to work back up here real quick, because there was just the... There was the elevator at the top of this, and I'm curious where that would have taken us. Boy, no matter the time of day. Gorgeous. Did I cover all this more thoroughly? Too? I don't think I did. In a way, this almost feels like this is sort of the main path. <laughs> Elevator first, one thing at a time. While I'm thinking of it. Okay, and here you are, I think. Roughly. Yeah, here you are. Okay. Where are we going? Oh. More of this. Hello. Hey, I'm having a good time with a sword. Glad I leveled it up for use. So many fun weapons. Just in the DLC alone, I already have, like, more toys than I know what to do with. Ugh, there's a bunch of ya. Hmm. Might be time for Rot. Yeah, it might be time for Big Rot Breath. I think. Let's do it. Have fun, y'all. Enjoy! Oh yeah, bunch up some more if you don't mind. I love it. Thank you. That went great. I'll just wait y'all out. <laughs> I'm brilliant. Thank you. Doesn't seem to be a whole lot down here yet, but let's see where this spits us out. Um... Okay, we're here. We haven't really been on this level yet, I don't think. Another one of those things, or maybe it's the same one of those things. It's the same one of those things. Yeah, yeah, that's the... Mesmer camp right outside the castle over there. It's 
Stairs down, another hippo. Nope, oh, no sneaking. Take care of you. Take care of you. No. Gross. Quite a complex space to explore. Not quite as much as the keep was, but uh, ugh, boy, that this this seems risky. Like I could make it from this one to that one. I don't know if that's a safe spot to land. Yeah, not sure I like that plan. Let's take the stairs down. That seems safer. Even with the hippo. You know what? Why not? Mira? Can I get a hand with this? It's very full of health. Ow. Don't get eaten. Door smashed. Almost got it. There we go. Thank you, Mira. Appreciate it. Yeah. Love that we're still getting those. Hmm. Didn't miss anything up here, right? Doesn't look like it, but then I think almost every time I've said that without fail, I have been missing something. Oh well, I'd hate to break the streak now. Yoo-hoo! Hello, turtles. Tortoises. Tortoises. Whatever. Hmm... Hmm... I don't think so, no. That seems... like not a good idea. And also, I think that... that's where I just was over there. Yeah. Yeah, pretty sure that's where I just was. Cool, okay. I think that means I've covered most all of this. I think. Mostly. I think so. There is, I guess, the main path. We could try the main path. Just for kicks.
It might be that it just kind of leads to a place that we got by other means, but it is scenic. That's worth something. Hmm. I see someone with a vase in the far distance. And maybe goodies for me. They better not vanish on me. Let's get him. Get him quick. There we go. Beautiful. Ah, one of you. Hooray. I like these enemies. They're tricky for sure. And they get behind your shield pretty good. Their movement's really neat though. And what a cool grab. Gotcha, all right. I was very focused for a second there. <laughs> Not a lot of talking. And we've not been in this exact part yet, I don't think. It's like the top floor of this little... Temple doesn't feel like the right word. Don't cast cool little spells at me, guys. Hmm. Oh, this is where I was, I think. Okay. I thought I was going to be fighting you later. Later. Ow. Stop. There's a lot of you. And you're kind of obnoxious. Alright. It's enough, small fry. Clear out. We're done. Yeah. But yeah, I think this is where I actually got myself in here first. Yeah. Ah. Uh -huh. No. Yeah, there should be a few right over there. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. And that's the two that jumped me from the... Yeah. Okay. All right. So we found one way this connects. Nope. Eh. Hmm. Just grabbing a few things like that, if you don't mind. And then, yeah, I think... I think that means I've probably explored a lot of the rest of this. Again, it's like, it's not a temple exactly, but I don't know what to call it. It's neat, though. But 
But yeah, I'm feeling reasonably satisfied with my exploration of that part of the ruins. So let's get ourselves back down here. And then on Thursday, we will continue exploring around here, maybe start making our way over. Possibly. Because there's still all, like, all this over here. Whatever it is. And it's so pretty. Anyway, thank you all for watching. I'll see you tomorrow for a one-off of some sort. And then see you on Thursday for more of this. Bye-bye!